Hello, everyone. Good afternoon. My name is Yi Sun, and today I'm going to talk about my practical outcomes of said projects from Unit One. My presentation will take around seven minutes, and if you want to, you can ask me any questions after I finish. So, firstly, I will give you just a short briefing about description of my Unit One. Secondly, I will describe the and analyze the project one and project two processes and the outcomes. Thirdly, I will talk about my ideas and overview of the major project proposal. Then finally, I will talk about the summary of the whole unit one. So to start, firstly, from project one to project five, I learned a lot from many interesting points at the beginning to the research of the selected theme. From a vague idea to a perfect work, for project one, I chose the theme of the universe. After selecting the theme, I conducted primary research and secondary research on the universe and combined the research results to draw the drafts. In the project two, I have sorted out, summarized, and sorted according to the survey data and draft in project one, and further refined and researched the universe. In the end. I have drew some works on the painting techniques by using etching, lithography, and digital painting. And finally, for Project Five, I will continue the scene and research in Project One to Project Two in the future, and make prospects and plans for Unit Two and Unit Three. Secondly, for Project One, I chose the universe because I am a science fiction fan and keen to watch science fiction movies. I have a keen interest in the universe. First, I used the workshop to create a series of lithography of the universe as a preliminary practice. However, in the further investigation, I began to think about how to create according to this theme. So I first conducted primary research. I started thinking about the relationship between myself and humanity and the universe. So I thought that. In some images that we've seen of the universe, some of the images、um, of galaxies are very similar to human organs or human cells. I've learned from YouTube videos and books about the universe that the universe may have similar structures to human organs, like the brain.、Um, based on a series of investigations, I created some drafts that drew. Parallels between the universe, human organs, and cells. In research, I gradually found that the concept of the universe is very big, and the universe I have、um, studied is only two-dimensional images of the universe, which cannot cover the vast universe. So I decided to choose a more specific idea from my concept of the universe. Which was a key turning point from a very large concept. In Project Two, I continued the exploration of Project One and focused on the exploration of different planets in the universe, as well as the materials and elements that make up the planets. In the process, I came up with a new idea, which is to use my imagination to create some fantasy planets and civilizations on them. To show a different way of living from the Earth, imagination and creation of the unknown realm of the universe. In the secondary research of Project Two, I investigated、uh, exoplanets and solar system planets respectively, and this became part of the project content. For example, in the research of exoplanets, there are many strange planets. Such as、um, desert planets, lava planets, gas planets, and ocean planets. Among them, I focused on the environmental research and analysis of the lava planets K two one hundred forty one B, abstracted the environmental state described in the lava planet, and gave my imagination to create the plants and organisms growing on the lava planets, as well as their evolution. For example, in the character setting, because the surface of the lava planets can reach the ultra high temperature of one thousand seven hundred and sixty six degrees centigrade, 
I set the character with only one eye and bare skin so as to adapt to the environment on the lava planet. Secondly, I imitated and created according to the characteristics of human evolution process in biology. This shows the initial practice and consideration of the past, present, and future of lava planet civilization. In terms of patent methods, I have made use of different workshops, such as lithography and etching, and have expanded the painting methods by using digital painting. I finally chose digital painting to present the final outcome, because digital painting can easily show bright and strong colors, which coincides with the lava world I want to show. Thirdly, from the major project proposal, in the expression of Unit 1, I have constructed the imagination of lava planets and made a preliminary practice to construct lava planet civilization. Therefore, in the following Unit 2 and Unit 3, I will continue this idea and the outcome of Project 2, enriching civilizations on lava planets and building other imaginary exoplanet worlds. In terms of location orientation, the outcome can be located in science gallery and art gallery. In this way, the illustration shows the civilization on the exoplanets and takes this as a correlation with human civilization. So as to discuss more about the past, present, and future of civilization, and to map and human society and reflect on social issues. Finally, reflect on and summarize my whole process. In the whole process of Unit 1, from a very vague point to now about to be a complete outcome, I have gained a lot. These processes not only satisfied my interest and curiosity as a science fiction fan, but also made many new practices that I had never made before. The reflection on the whole process also made me understand my creation goal and significance more clearly. Thank you for your attention. Thanks to my tutor and classmates. That's all.